Sweet, sweet, sweet Rooney. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. And today I'm gonna to be reacting to Collapse of Colors latest single, Hopeless. If you wanna jump straight into the reaction, jump to this time. Otherwise, stick around and you'll learn a bit about the band. So Collapse of Colour are a local metalcore band. My band Nephilim has played with them a couple of times. They're great lads and it's really nice to hear a band of a similar genre, especially in like the local scene. The band consists of four members, Evan on lead vocals. He's a class from on by the way. We've got Jack on guitar, he's a very friendly guy. We've got Daniel on bass, he's like got so many cool tattoos. Fun fact about Daniel is he saved the day at our album launch show. Ace, who is our bassist, uh, his guitar actually went kaput for some reason when we were about to go on stage. So Daniel lent him his and big thanks to him because he really did save the show. And last but not least, we have Tom on drums and Tom's just a genuinely really friendly guy. So Nephilim have gigged with Collapse of Colour quite a few times to be honest. Other than our album on show, which was like really good fun. Um, one of the best gigs we ever played with them was at the final of Metal to the Masses 2019. On the same lineup was Rituals. If you haven't already, check out my reaction to Rituals song Snake's Head, should be linked above. But anyway, back to Collapse of Colour. Before launching their latest single Hopeless, Collapse of Colour had actually released an EP called Drowning Sharks. This was their debut release. You may look back at it after Hopeless and think it's a bit rough around the edges because I've heard that the production is next level on the latest single. However, I would definitely recommend giving it a go. I quite enjoyed it and seeing the songs live, obviously I knew them. I am actually really excited to get into this and it's great to have local bands interested in, in me reacting to the video. So big thanks to Collapse of Colour for asking me to do this. Oh, by the way, this is a music video as well, so you'll be able to watch it with me while I'm reacting. Without further ado, let's dive straight into the reaction. Oh, just get me headphones on. Here we go. Oh, it's sounding jazzy already. Oh, this is sounding really cool. Here we go. Oh, that's nice. Got a chugging. Rubbish on clean vocals, Jack. No, I'm kidding. Obviously, they're, they're not. But it's an inside joke. The video's looking really cool as well. I feel like I recognise this, I don't know, could be wrong, but they might have played this live before, before it's been released. Wow, I've just noticed uh, Dan's new hair looks flipping cool. Let's go. I like that riff a lot. That was pretty heavy, that like, I loved it. I think uh, Evan's vocals are like really, really cool as well, especially when you're live, like he just goes for it. And yeah, 
I can definitely see the improvement in the sound quality and the production already, so. I wonder who the dude is in the video. I need to know who that dude is. I'm gonna give Evan a message before I release this video. Give him a shout out. Shout out to Jezza Bruce. Yeah. It's a cool chorus. This. Yeah. I like this bit, right, because it's like Jack does the, the leading of the vocals in the chorus and then like Evan comes in, but he's not like full on screaming like he would say in the verse. So it's really nice to get that contrast between the two like clean vocals. And by the looks of it, Jack's going to be like doing some like, ooh, baby stuff in the background here. Oh, that is nice. There's the bass that was uh, borrowed at our album launch there. Oh, that's nice, man. It's a, a vibey part. That's nice, man. That is class. Oh man, that breakdown. That was so cool. I loved the, the bit into the breakdown where Tom had, I don't know what it was, but he had stuff on his cymbals and it just like went everywhere. That looked like really mint. Ooh, bit of ride action. Yeah, man. Yeah, that chorus is cool. Ah, sorry, I was I'm buttoning in on Evan here. No, I honestly think that, that, that chorus is really cool and yeah, like I say, I feel like I recognise it. I don't know why. But for me, the song as a whole is like an improvement from the Drowning Sharks EP already. Like, not not just production and stuff, but just like the writing as well. So. Oh, that looks good, the fire. Like, slow down. <laughs> Evan looked proper angry there, that was awesome. I wonder how much that uh, frames were as well, setting that on fire. Oh, that happens dope, man. Collapse Colour. JWA Creations. Ah, so he must have done the video. Yeah, so, so like, first off, that was over five minutes long, but it just it genuinely really didn't feel like that. I think it's a really good thing because sometimes when you're listening to bands, you think, oh, this song's a bit long. Oh but I really didn't get that vibe. I definitely think the boys have took it to the next level from the first release, and 
having a music video, like, it's really good quality. In the video, everyone's just, like, going for it. It's, like, always really nice to see, I think. I'm probably going to put that up there as my favourite song. Potentially, you could argue that it's because it is the best sounding. For me, the chorus is really good, and there's that breakdown in the middle. It's awesome as well. But I do wonder if the webs we weave was the same audio quality as Hopeless. Would that be a contender? Who knows? I'm sure for the lads it's really nice to see people releasing stuff, especially throughout everything that's going on at the moment. Big up Collapse of Colour. As you can see they've like updated the logo and everything and I think it's nice to see like the evolution of the band. Also how massive is Evan's beard? Let's get a close up of that for you. I'm going to link you the original video uh, in my description below. The song's going to be released on everything you know from Spotify, Bandcamp, you know, all that jazz. You like jazz? You like jazz? I'm going to tack this on at the end of the video. This is more an update from me. I haven't uploaded it in ages and I'm really sorry about that. But, you know, this year has been a bit crazy. There's a lot of stuff going on and just almost finding the inspiration to do videos is quite hard sometimes. So I, I guess I took a bit of a break. But, like, I've actually really enjoyed filming this today. And I just want to say thanks to the boys because really views have inspired me to make another video. It gave me a reason to do it. So couldn't let you down. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you're going to support Collapse of Colour. I honestly think we've done a class job and I really, really enjoy the new song. Give us a cheeky subscribe. I really appreciate it. I really want to hit 200 by the end of this year. I think we're on about like 185 or something around that region, which is just mad anyway, because, you know, I've been a lazy bum for the last two months. Without further ado, I'm going to say bye.